Supply chain security is a very complex problem. When we think about what the supply chain is for a device, we mean from the moment a company conceives of a device and starts designing it and starts building components for it and all of their suppliers that come into it, everything from the companies that build the microcontrollers that go onto the board to the boards themselves to all of the software vendors that they might be using, everything from open source components to um, vendors who are building specific software for, for a device, that all makes up the supply chain for that device. Probably thousands of engineers, dozens of companies all contribute to a device before it lands on your network. And what we're trying to do is make that supply chain more transparent so that you understand what is inside of that device. What are the possible risks associated with that? Are there vulnerabilities in that device? Are there possible back doors embedded in that device that you don't want to have exposed on your network? So building a device and getting it to market and, and supporting it and, and selling it is hard. The reason we see so many security issues in these devices is they tend to be in highly competitive markets where they need to get the product out to market quickly. And like we talked about with supply chains, they're very complicated. There's a lot of vendors involved. It's the responsibility of the original equipment manufacturer, the final label that you see on that device, to secure these devices and make sure that their supply chains are secure and make sure that the components that they're using aren't going to lead to an exposure of that device.